everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to the Jedi Knight, episode 4, look at T7 spinning. You've got a T7 as well? A T7's common? What? So last time I asked you guys to decide what mount I should get, and only a couple of you responded. One of you told me to get a Ranker. No, no, I'm not going to get a Ranker for this character. It won't fit, so the mount I decided to go with in the end is the Desolate DA5. I completely forgot what it was just called, even though I just had my mouse over it, which is this one. It's blue, I know, but it suits her because, of course, she has the blue Montreals, and uh, she is Republic. I know she's dark side, but hey, she is Republic, and it sort of suits her Republic theme. And it's just, I don't know, it's sort of, sort of elegant for her style, so it is quite a nice mount in my eyes. But anyway, last time we were told to go and speak to Kira Carson because Dr. Tarnas has been kidnapped! Oh no! And we need to go and speak to Kira and ask her security team, or ask her to ask her security team to save them. Just in time. These guys get points for courage, but we're a little outnumbered. There's more than a few trigger-happy thugs in that docking bay. T7 cents indicate more than a few enemies. <laughs> the kidnappers are threatening to kill Dr. Tarnas, but they might be bluffing. I'm not even sure they have him. If they don't have the doctor, they're no use to us. We lost the other kidnappers. This bunch is our best shot at saving Tarnas. So, how do we handle this? The dark side route, of course. Even though there is no dark side route. Uh, let's improvise. I say we bust in there, weapons drawn, and see what happens. Give me a second to paint a target on my forehead. I borrowed a stealth field generator from Agent Galen's office. Makes me practically invisible. I can sneak in first, then when you attack, I'll take a few thugs by surprise. What do you think? The last thing I need is an overeager Padawan tripping me up. The only reason I'm still a Padawan is because of my master. I've passed every test. Master Quix just doesn't think I'm serious enough to be a full Jedi. You're, you're like me then. It. Give me a chance. So she is like the female version of me. Yeah, I mean I have good ideas sometimes. It's just I'm I'm not serious when I'm, I'll be like, "Yay, let's kill people!" Rather than we're gonna kill people. Ah. If you get killed, I'll be very upset. <laughs> not half as upset as I'll be. Activating stealth field. You'll be dead. I'll get into position and attack on your signal. Let's rescue us a doctor. Doctor who? Rescuing the doctor? <gasps> Maybe we are his companions. That'd be really cool if the doctor actually went to the Star Wars universe. Obviously, that would break all sorts of canon, but it is it is kind of a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Well, the doctor could do that. He can go a long time ago and go to a galaxy far, far away. He can go to the end of the universe, for crying out loud. Uh, right, uh, where are we actually going? Um, um, is Dr. Tarnas this way? I don't know. I think he's, uh, oh yeah, I think he's up there. Alright, should I just skip past? Yeah, I'll skip past all of you. I always say bass for some reason. I'll skip bass all of you. <laughs> uh, and up here. Am I going the right way? I don't know. Yes, I am. Lovely. <laughs> Kira, no! You'll pay for what you just did! That's you, Dad! Oh, better get rid of the Black Sun Rider first! And there we go. I should probably turn my volume down on my headset because if I don't, then I'll pick it up in my microphone. Uh, pick up the loot. Pick, pick, pick up the loot. Thank you. Uh, Jedi scum! I'll kill you someday. Not I if I kill, kill you my first. Steel generator. Oh well, that was fun while it lasted. Isn't teamwork grand? Uh, no sign of time. doctor anywhere. We were the decoys. Now you'll never see your little doctor again. Is that so? Give me a minute with this guy. I'll make him talk. Be my guest. Nothing else? This'll be entertaining. Thanks for the encouragement. Thing is, we don't need him to talk. Not when I can just read his mind. Oh. Stop that! Get out of my head! Get out! The doctor's in the Black Sun headquarters. Salar has him. Just leave me alone. Cheap thugs will believe anything. 
I can't read your mind, stupid. <laughs> you, you tricked me. If she hadn't, you'd be dealing with me right now. He already talked. There's no need to play light Jedi, dark Jedi with him. You were the Tarnas light one? The major crime syndicate. Whatever they want with Tarnas, we'd better save him quick. Me and my security detail will clean this up. Agent Galen will want to hear about this. Sorry, but you are pretending you are going to go read his mind. That's not a light side trick. If anything, that is pure dark side. Pure dark side. Uh, I need to speak to Agent Galen, who I'm guessing is all the way back at the Senate Tower. Joy. See, the way I plan to play it with Kira as well, I'm just going to try and be not too much of an ass to her because I like Kira. I know this is the dark side playthrough. So, so, well, a couple of you were sort of saying to me last time, well, you're dark side. Do pure dark side. Well, I will. I will. Every every time there's a dark side option, I'll either go for the dark side option or just the just the blank option. I won't ever go for a light side option. Ever. That's 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 the plan. But most of the time I will go for dark side because sometimes sometimes I wanna just try and see if I can keep someone alive. See what happens in the future. See if they come back maybe. Which is why I left what's his face, Bengal Moore alive. Uh Although that was still technically dark side, but I still kept him alive just to see what happens later on. I doubt anything will happen. It's like, who is it? On my Sith Warrior. Spoilers if you haven't watched my Sith Warrior, but I'm sure most of you have. On my Sith Warrior playthrough, who was it I kept alive? I kept that uh, that cyborg guy alive, wasn't it? I, it was a lot. This was a long time ago, so I barely remember it now. And he came back f just to witness my. Succession, and that's it. So, I'm wondering if it would just be like that, to be honest. But we shall see. We shall see. Agent Galen, we've sort of succeeded, ish. Where are you? Where are you? Doctor Tarnas is the least of our worries, General. The stolen data files had details, not only on the planet prison, but every weapon prototype and research facility in existence. Why would you put Those it all in powerful there? Powerful experimental weapons, and Black Sun has access to them. How could this happen? If I were you, I'd start looking for a new job. That's enough. Assigning blame is a luxury we don't have. We must act quickly to secure these other weapons. Where are they? Three off-world research facilities. Minimal defenses to give them a low profile. They're vulnerable. Master Kiewicz and I will split up and protect two. And I'll take the third one. You get the fun part. Rescuing Dr. Tarnas and the copied data files from Black Sun. Oh, good. Another exciting rescue mission. Saving lives is what Jedi do. Get used to it. You <laughs> will stay behind too. With Agent Galen leaving, her computer talents will be needed. She can be impulsive, but give her a chance. You'll make a good team. I hope that turns out to be the case. Kira is a good person. She simply needs strong guidance. You think Where I'm it? Go. May the Force be with us all. Oh God! I'll escort you to your ships, my friends. Before I go, I'm putting all my resources at your disposal. There's a special tactical unit in Black Sun Territory. Experienced security officers who've been fighting those gangsters for months. Go to these coordinates. Talk to Sergeant Nidaljo. He can help you rescue Dr. Tarnas and get those copied data files. Your man better have a strong stomach. Those gangsters are going to learn the meaning of pain. They're already familiar with that topic. Don't underestimate the Black Sun gang. They enjoy killing. And they're good at it. So am I. I'll get her plugged into our security network before I leave. Good luck. Well, not good at it, but I enjoy it. I enjoy killing in this game. And I'll take those. Level 16. Ability she... Mastery... Tri what? She show Mastery... What? What? Why? Why are you... Okay. Oh! Oh, oh, hold on. Ah, there we go. She turn form increases armor penetration by 30%. Which is what I've got. Lovely. What abilities have we got as well? Why am I walking into a wall? I have no idea. I haven't got rid of these abilities yet. Abilities, these items, whatever it is. Uh, Repost, rank 2. Guard, which is the tank thing, even though I never use that. But you can go there. Anything on my Jedi Knight? Slash rank 5. Wonderful. I've also got to check my mail as well because they've had the... Seriously, where am I going? I feel lost. Going this way. They've had their... Swear to have done their live stream for Knights of the Fallen Empire and I want to see what I've got in my uh, cantina box. So let's go find that. Let's go find a mailbox and find out.
Don't you just love gold spammers? I, I will say gold spammers, credit spammers. It's kind of the same thing. Case file, something, 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 something. Yeah, I can't read that. Well, I can't read it. I just can't be bothered. If you want to pause the video and read it, you can. There we go. And Seattle Cantina Tour bonus. Thank you for attending the community cantina tour held in Seattle. <laughs> That wasn't one. It was a live stream. And let's see what we got. Uh, where, where's the box gone? There it is. Wait, is that it? Yes, yes it is. We got an experience boost and, of course, the Prino Aggregate. Let's take a look at that, shall we? We shall. I know this won't be her mount. Ooh, it's a uh, sort of silverish, yellowish, bluish kind of color. Again. Sounds like a washing machine. At some point as well, I need to go to the public fleet and get her some uh, better armorings and all that. Because, I, I mean, we've got enough to, I don't know, just sort of get her somewhere. Although, I do need to make her wear these. Because, of course, yeah, look at her. Look at her gear right now. That is actually what her stats are. Um, so, yes, I need to put a slot on. I need to put something in every slot. And, uh, well, yeah. Ah, hello, yeah, Republic Medical Droid. Sell my junk. I don't need you. I don't need you. And I don't need you. And I don't need you. Or you. Or you. Uh, let's sort by whatever. Ooh, I've still got that in my thingy. And uh, we will take some strength stims. Thank you very much. And some med packs as well. Uh, we need general med packs. Wonderful. Have I really got that much money? Buy me. I can't. I, I, I guess I transferred some money over from Kranitoko. All right, let's put you in there, and away we go again. Aw, the effects with T7 is low. Aw, he doesn't like me right now. God damn you, T7. Why don't you just hate everyone like I do? Can we fit through the door? We can. Wonderful. Right. Uh, of course, there would be enemies, and away we go. But, of course, T7 could do all the fighting for me, really, because uh, T7 is way too powerful at the moment. Actually, no, maybe it's because we're both too powerful. I mean, what? These are level 12, and I'm level 16. So, yeah, T7 is kind of powerful as well. Maybe that explains a lot. Ooh, I wonder what that says. I don't have my Orabesh translator. I, I was trying to learn Orabesh at one time, but I just stopped learning it. Oh, yeah, I see you. I see you. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I just stopped learning it, but I really want to try and get back into it so that I can... I don't know, go watch The Force Awakens and be all like, <gasps> I know what that means! Why well, do I get the feeling Ninjago, how you say your name, is an alien? Corporal, get a culto pack on that man. Oh, you're not. The rest of you prep for evac. Sounded like an alien name. Me. What's happened? Black Sun. They're not a gang anymore, they were an army. We were securing a perimeter around their base for you. They hit back with military grade weapons, killed six of my men. Seven, sir. Joran's gone. Oh no. Not equipped for this fight. Not anymore. We can't help you. You'll finish the mission whether you're equipped for it or not. I don't take orders from you, and we didn't sign up for a suicide run. Did you not? We've been fighting Black Sun for months. Now with new weapons and armor, they're unstoppable. <laughs> Jedi plus T7 equals stop the unstoppable every day. We're half dead. And they didn't suffer a single casualty. There's no hope of victory. You men will do everything you can to assist me. We're going to the base. Now. We're going to the base now. On your feet, men. Ration your medical supplies and give some to the Jedi. Oh, thank you. The enemy has a computerized security network. We'll keep their forces busy while you take it out. Once it's down, we'll make a frontal assault and clear a path for you. That wasn't so difficult now, was it? You certainly put the fight back in us. Oh, really? Sergeant equals logic carrier. T7 cannot resolve. Like this. We'll see you inside the base. It's almost like I took over your mind. It's, oh. How about that, T7? It's, it's. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. You just started following me. <laughs> anyway. Uh, right, the first one we need to disable... For a second I thought the door closed behind me then. The first one we need to disable is over here. Oh, hello! You're a Jedi too. Oh, you're a Jedi Sentinel. I see. Well, you could have just... Uh, thanks! Yeah, thanks for destroying this for me. And now I've got to wait. Joy. And destroyed. Now for the other three. 
I'm too, too, too close. What? Oh, oh yeah, of course, you've got to be out of distance to use that ability. Oh, for a second there, I thought my mount was bugging it out, which was weird. Oh well. Oh, a bonus mission. I haven't done one of those in a little while. Oh, you're dead anyway. Well, T7 will. Pick up the pieces for me. Wonderful. Oh yeah, somebody did mention to me that I shouldn't have this utility. I should have the Master Strike one. So, I'll reset that, and I'll get, I'll get that next time in the Defiance, and I'll get the Master Strike. Lovely. Although that was that was still a great ability when I got stunned, but oh well. People don't like me when I do the wrong things. Oh god, they won't stop attacking me. They won't stop attacking me. T7, go attack. No? Alright, I'll attack for you. Sorry, I yeah, sorry, I took it from you. I'm so sorry. So sorry. Wow, they they died pretty quickly. Right, where are we going? We need to go. Should I finish this bonus mission? For 2,000, ex <laughs> 2000 experience. Nah, why is it, for some reason, I don't know if this is showing up in the recording, but for some reason Star Wars is just flickering for me. Which is weird. It's like, there was like a black, it was just flickered to black for like a split second, which was weird. Anyway, we need to go this way. No, you're an outlaw, you won't hurt me. See, I, I will admit, in like the early levels of SWOTOR, hold on. In the early levels of SWOTOR, the, the levels were pretty pretty. Pretty pretty? We're quite pretty. You know what I mean. Uh, Salah! Tarnus, we risked everything for you. Stealing those data files, faking your kidnapping. This is how you repay us? What? You were compensated with enough weapons and armor to make Black Sun invincible. Invincible? There's a Jedi carving up my base. This is your fault. We never should have trusted a Sith. If a Jedi has come for you, Salar, it wasn't my doing. Hello? Your own people gave you up, not Tarnus. How predictable. I have no time for this nonsense. Finish your pointless battle. Coruscant's fate is already sealed. Do a barrel roll. <laughs> Hello? Surrender, you scum. We got you surrounded. That sounds very. That sounds like a very dumb thing to say. It's almost like you're being like, "Surrender, you scum! We got you surrounded!" And then it all goes wrong. Nice of you to join the party. Wouldn't miss it. Kill them all! Well, it's five against three. How do you reckon that's going to work out for you? I reckon you will die. Much like that. See? Told you you'd die. Hooray. Speak to Sergeant Nid... How do you say your name again? Nidaljo. Lost near everyone. But Salar's dead. And the Black Sun base is in ruins. You're welcome to leave. Wasn't planning to stay. There aren't enough of us to hold this base. Black Sun reinforcements are coming. There you are. We intercepted Salar's holocaul to Tarnas. Can't believe he's a Sith. That's not the worst news. The Planet Prison prototype here at the lab? A fake. Tarnas stole the real Planet Prison. Of course he did. Tarnas is dead. He just doesn't know it. We need you back at the Senate Tower. Kira out. Sounds like your work is just starting. We won't hold you up. Goodbye, Jedi. Goodbye, Jedi. At what point do you become yourselves again? I've always wondered that with uh, Force Persuade. Like, you control their minds. Are they aware that you've controlled their minds? I mean, sometimes some people can break out of it and then they are aware, but at one po what point do you get your mind back? Or, are they, or is their mind forever taken over by Jedi in a sense? Again, it just flickered. Why did it do that? I've always wondered about, about Force Persuade with that. It's a curious thing. It's a very curious thing. I assume it's a bit like hypnotism, but once again, at what point in hypnotism do you realize you have your mind back? It's like when people say that they used a hypnotist to get rid of a fear from them. Let's say, let's say you have like a fear of spiders, a massive fear of spiders, and then you go to a hypnotist and they take that fear out of you. Well, do you still technically have your mind, or has the hypnotist got hold of your mind forever? Like, I, I don't know, how do you... How do you just lose a fear like that? I, unless I'm hypnotized myself, I will never know. General Varsuthra, I have arrived. I know it's a shock about Tarnas. A Sith, working as my chief scientist. 
How can I defend the Republic if I can't trust my own people? Can we trust entire you? Our engineering team vanished along with the planet prison. They're all traitors too. Tarnas couldn't pull this off by himself. I've known that team for years. I never saw a hint they were anything less than patriots. Tarnas will use the planet prison against Coruscant. He could trap us here forever, paralyze the Republic by holding us hostage. You're our only hope of stopping that. Don't tell me I'm the only Jedi on Coruscant. Your masters are in hyperspace. You and Kira are the only Jedi with the Council's authorization. For good reason. We're both amazing. Indeed. I just traced that hollow call we intercepted from the Black Sun base. Tarnas was communicating from down in Sector 439. Justicar territory. Tarnas knows we're not welcome there. Justicars are paramilitary vigilantes. They took over a sector, cut ties with the rest of Coruscant, and they don't like visitors. If their leaders understood the situation, they'd work with us. We have no way to contact them and no time for diplomacy. Justicars are well trained and armed, but they don't concern me. It's the Sith Lord I'm worried about. You shouldn't face Tarnas alone. I may only be a Padawan, but I can help you. Uh, bad idea. You're inexperienced and headstrong. I can't trust you with this. But I do. Coruscant's fate lies in the balance, and Kira's proven very capable. She's going. You don't You'll boss me around. This is done. I promise. T7, wait here. Kira and Jedi, be careful. Stop be fast. Thomas before he uses the planet prison against us. The fate of the Republic rests on your shoulders, Jedi. May the Force be with you. You're not a Jedi. You don't have the right to say that. God. Uh, select one reward. I guess these are exactly the same. What? Oh, that, that has more. Uh, that has more armor. And of course, I'm a juggernaut now. Not a juggernaut. I'm a guardian, but you know what I mean. And that means I can wear heavy armor. Lovely. And I'm level 17. What new abilities have we got? We got Sundering Strike, rank two. Is there anything in terms of utility wise? No, not until level 19. All right. So I think that will finish up this episode for now. Uh, in the next episode, we gotta go locate Tarnis and then probably finish off Coruscant. And we've also got Kira as a companion. And I love, I, when I did the light side Jedi Knight, I used to love Kira. I always had Kira out, which may be the case again. Because I get the feeling she just might be like me sometimes. She just jumps in first, asks questions later. Sometimes. Not all the time. Sometimes. Oh, I like your armor. Is that the armor? Wait, that's the armor I used to wear on Crown Zogo, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, so that's it for the time being. So thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you next time. And a farewell to you. <laughs>